The Ultimax cover has been designed to allow for easy inspection and in many instances it will not be necessary to remove both covers. Before attempting to remove the covers, ensure the keyways are clean and free from debris. Insert the prising bar into the slot on the master cover and release the automatic locking mechanism. Using the slave cover as a platform, pull on the bar and walk the cover back towards the hinges. The master cover meets a natural stop just past 90 degrees. To remove completely, simply lift the cover vertically. Ensure that the hinge sockets and seating areas are clean and free from debris. To remove the slave cover, engage two lifting keys in the keyways. Lift the cover vertically and place to the side of the chamber. Using a longer lifting keys will ensure a safer and easier lift. When replacing the slave cover, be aware that there is a stud on the cover casting which locates with a socket in the corner of the frame, so ensure that this engages before lowering the cover into place. Lower the master cover and line up with the hinges in the slave unit. Insert the lifting key into the hidden keyhole in the master cover and rotate it 90 degrees so the key can be felt to engage onto the safety locking mechanism inside the keyway. Lower the cover until almost horizontal. Remove the key and kick down on the cover nose to re-engage the spring bar locking mechanism.